Hello, hello. I've arrived. All right, so tonight is more Tales of Arise. Yeah, it's been a good long while since we've played this, huh? It certainly feels like it. But yes. So, before we get into the game, before we get into the game, hold on, I need to clean my glasses. I didn't do a very good job of that <laughs> before I got started here. But yes. So, where was I? So yes, business. Before we get started, we're going to go over the business. So, as you can tell, probably it's Saturday, which is not the a day that I normally stream on. But yeah. So, I was feeling a little bit sick yesterday. I was feeling a little bit sick yesterday, so I had to uh, cancel. And uh, I was feeling a little bit ill for a little bit today. And I was worried that I might have to cancel again, but I'm feeling pretty all right now. No particular complaints. So... I think we should be fine. I might make this a little bit of a shorter stream than usual, just to be on the safe side, give myself some more time to rest and all that. But, uh, let's see, other than that, next week should be more of the usual. I don't anticipate any abrupt changes to my schedule. So, in that case, assuming that all is well, you should see some more streams, 8.30 p.m. Central Time, throughout the throughout the next week, at least on the, the usual days. Yes, Tuesday, we'll be starting up a new game. We will be playing some Arknights. Yeah, certainly, I've been wanting to play that game for a long time on stream. <laughs> I've been wanting to play that game on stream for a long time, and I've sort of held off on playing it casually, because usually, usually I try to, I don't know, I guess I don't really try to, but most of the games that I end up playing on stream are games that I'm playing for the first time. That's something, that is something that I aimed for in the past, but I think I'm, I don't know, I didn't, I didn't really like the, that restriction, so I am no longer abiding by it. It was never a particularly strict restriction regardless, or a particularly, one that I particularly enforced. But yes. So anyway, like I was saying, uh, Tuesday we'll be playing some Arknights, Wednesday and Friday we should be seeing some more Tales of Arise, and Thursday we should be continuing with the usual collab with Sheppy Sheps, playing some Valhalla cyberpunk bartender action. But yes. So, I guess that's basically everything that needs to be said, everything that is relevant here. Yeah. Adjusted some settings a little bit with my model, so things should be a little bit nicer, maybe. Little tweaks here and there, probably not things that are going to be super noticeable. But, uh, and yeah, I should say that's with my model settings in VTube Studio, not the actual physical model itself, as it were. But yes, so with all of that out of the way, I suppose we're about ready to start. Like I said, might be a little bit of a short stream today. And, yeah, I guess that's basically everything that needs to be said. So, video games. Oh, why is my controller not working? Ah, because I don't have the... <laughs> I don't have the game uh, selected. How to do it? Oh, nope, it's still not working. Uh-oh. Hmm. Uh-oh. What's going on here? Because, yeah, the... Oh. Oh, right, right, right. There we go. Slight technical difficulties, but we should be fine now. Ba -ba -ba. And switching over to the game. There we go. And I even remember to change the... <laughs> even remember to change the now playing section. Wow. Incredible. But yes. So, it's been a good long while since we played Tales of Arise, like I said. <clears throat> so I guess by way of a little recap, we uh, recently entered the, the realm. Oh, maybe I needed to give myself a recap before we started because I can't remember the name of it offhand. Uh, <laughs> Mahogsar, there we go. Yes, we recently entered the realm of Mahogsar, seeking to liberate it as we have the other realms from their oppressive uh, Renan overlords only to find that the realm has uh, liberated itself, basically. <laughs> the city of Niaz is in a pretty rough state, to be honest. It's in a pretty rough state. 
the people there. Uh, oh, is there a side quest I didn't pick up? Now I'm going to have to remedy that. But yes, the people of Niaz have uh, yeah, overthrown their Renan rulers. And uh, it's not as good as it could be. <laughs> Certainly not as good as the other, the other places that we have liberated have been. Quick aside here. One thing that I've... Yeah, okay. I'm going to do the aside and then I'm going to talk about... And then I'm going to talk about asides. But yeah, so quick aside here. I now have... Uh, with the way that my setup is right now, I currently have the game on three on three different monitors. I have it on the one that's in front of me. I have it on one off to the side on my laptop, and I have it on one off to the other side. And the in the like, what's the word? Preview, sneak stream preview. I can run. I can do that right. And uh, so it's a little bit weird. It's a little bit weird seeing the game happening three times. The game happening three times at slightly different uh oh hey, this is the this is that guy from earlier, isn't it? Oh no, this or wait. This is this is a different guy. I was thinking that this was the fashion guy that we met all the way back in uh Calaglia, but this is a different guy. Elf and mi amigo, I knew fate would bring us together once more. Remind me, you're that wonder guy, is it? I am a minstrel who tells many a tale about this fleeting world in which we live. They call me the Wonder Bard. Right, I remember you. I believe we haven't had the pleasure, sir. You may call me Dohalim. You claim to be a minstrel. Is that is it is that to say you're well versed in music? Oh, but I am indeed. There isn't a song I haven't sung, nor an instrument my hands have not touched, mastered. Oh, also, do we have game audio? Oh, we don't. Okay, good. It's a good thing that I decided to check that uh, now, rather than later. So, you've certainly gone very long periods of time without me thinking to check that before. Hmm. Okay, for some reason this time we should have game audio and we just don't. Is that... Okay, I think it's fixed. Yeah, okay. That should be, that should be good. That should be good. Video games. Yes, just double checking again. <laughs> Apologies if I'm a little bit paranoid about that, but like I said, I've had a lot of bad, bad, uh, a lot of bad instances of forgetting that, especially in this game, really. Like, this has been, like, the game for me to forget audio in. I see. As it so happens, I am also a connoisseur of music myself. <laughs> Is that so? Perhaps I could, tr could I perhaps trouble you with a little rendition, kind sir? This is going to take a while, isn't it? Hmm. Alas, unfortunately I do not have any instruments on me, but I would be more than happy to indulge you with a short poem. In this sea of crimson trees, I spy an unknown, f I spy an unknown fellow, standing free within the breeze. Oh, Dana Mio! Your words are like music to my ears. You have quite the rare talent, sir, I must say. You really think so? That I do, and now I must return the favor in kind. Where do I begin, faced with such wit? Indeed, words fail me. I am at a loss. But what can I say but gracias? Oh. Oh-ho! You, sir, have thrown down the gauntlet. Allow me to... That's great. I can't take any more of this. We're leaving, Dohalim. You're welcome to catch up with us later. Excuse me! Wait, don't leave yet. With so many brilliant minds among you, perhaps I can entrust you all with the legendary instrument. What are you talking about? Oh, also, there's another thing that I need to do here. Okay, is that... Okay, we're good, we're good. I hid a musical instrument knowing someday I would find a worthy inheritor. You'll find it at the location detailed in these notes. But be warned, only the smartest shall solve the riddles contained within. <laughs> now I ask you, O oh chosen ones, will you take it upon yourself to solve the riddles and uncover the legendary instrument? Sure, let's give it a shot. Hmm. This talk of riddles and instruments has me most intrigued. Good. 
Very well, we accept your challenge. Excellent. I have complete faith that you shall emerge victorious. Wonder Tax 1. Just beyond the hovels in a, land, in a land shrouded by sand and stone. The northernmost reaches of a wasteland to the north of an abandoned village. It lies dormant at the back of a narrow road to the west, whereupon an ancient tower stands. Hmm. I remember... Well, I guess I was going to say... I was going to say we've seen a couple of... Or I was going to suggest the ancient tower. could mean anything. The ancient tower we were most recently at. For clues or something? Hey, maybe these are supposed to be different locations? Yeah, I was going to suggest oh, the ancient tower. Yeah, you're into this too, huh? Pardon? <laughs> I don't mean to interrupt. But uh, I was going to suggest the ancient tower that we were most recently at. The one, uh, I don't know, around... Where would it have been? This is, yeah, this is the area that we entered from. So it would have been back along this way. The ridge. And this is a, a pretty ancient tower. And a very notable one, too. But I think for right now, like I said, since this is going to be a little bit of a short one, I... Yeah, I made it that far, apparently. Yeah, since this is a, going to be a relatively short stream, most likely... Judging by the stench, I'd say the animals at the ranch are all I should do that. Now. I should work with that also here. But, uh, yeah, anyway, since this is probably going to be a little bit of a short stream, I'm going to stay focused on task. And while I talk about staying focused on task, or on the topic of staying focused on task, uh, one thing that I've been wanting to work on is I've been wanting to work on staying on task, basically. I want to, uh, I guess more so than that. Specifically, I want to improve my ability. Oh, I thought I was going to shoot him. Yes. All right. Now I need to remember how to play Xion, who's uh, <laughs> whose playing style is very different from all the other characters that I've played as. Sounds like a job for you, truly. All right. Oops. Shut him down. Steal that. Thank you. I guess. Yeah, we'll stay focused on you. Why not? Uh -oh. Yes. So as I was saying. As I was saying, I want to try and improve my ability to, yeah, keep on topic while I'm talking. Because I have a tendency to get very, very distracted. And, uh, well, you've seen that in action already, I suppose. Nice, nice one. And another solid strike. Very good, very good. I can feel my precision improving. I want to sort of have fewer asides when I'm trying to say something. Some asides here and there are fine, but I want to... Yeah, I want to be able to... Imp I want to improve my skill at maintaining a topic, at uh, staying focused. And sometimes, sometimes that's going to involve, I imagine, just not doing things to distract myself. Not getting into character dialogues and whatnot. Despite my, my fondness for them. I can wait a little bit while I make a point. Because yeah, when I when I interrupt myself, usually usually I forget what I was talking about. Usually I forget what I was talking about and I am not able to pick up the pick up the do I have No, okay. I was gonna say, do I have Luke uh, yeah, Luke Celestia equipped twice? But no. The other one is Ignis Celestra. But yeah, Xion's or yeah, Xion's fighting style is still pretty different from what I'm used to. There's always room for pretty different from what I'm used to in this game, and it's still not, I think, as engaging as the other characters. Unfortunately, with her, I don't know. So far as I've seen, l lower potential for combos and whatnot. Ooh, that's a nice shot. I think Hoodle senses something. I think Hoodle agrees. We've had Dohalim in the thumbnails a lot recently. I see plenty of ruins around here, too. It must have been a big town bustling with people back in the day. For crown Indeed. contest participants, places such as these are but vectors for the astral energy they pursue. I forgetting what button Similar I need to, to press to interact with for things. Instance. Windmills in this place are very, 
very cool looking, I must say. And yeah, it looks like we've got a lot of uh, wolf type enemies. So I think we're going to switch Dohalim back into the party, incidentally. Yeah, it doesn't make that much of a difference. <clears throat> but I think we're going to. And since we only really need one healer in the party at a time, we're going to keep, uh, yeah, we're going to keep, or we're going to take out Xion. You know what? Let's put Rinwell in. Let's sub her in for Law. We haven't been seeing a lot of armored enemies around. So yes. I wonder if I can hit multiple with my boost pick at once. It seems that the answer is yes. Very nice. Very good, very good. Alright, now I've... A very brief amount of time that I spent learning how to, or relearning rather, how to play Xion. Now I'm going to have to spend that time relearning how to, uh, how to play Doha League. Yes. Oh dear. Let's see, we can get some more, we can get another stun off. There we go. Or did they? It seems that they don't have the, uh, the visual effect on their legs, so that enemy seems to have not been stunned properly. Oh well. I wonder if I just missed, or if I... Well, no, because it would have, it like, appeared at their location. So presumably I would not have been able to miss, I would think. But I guess I might be wrong. But yeah. Dohalim's fighting style, it's a little bit easier than I remember it. I guess that's always sort of the case, you know? When you when you get back to doing something after having not done it for a while, personally at least I find it a lot easier, typically. I don't know, maybe depends on how long it's been and what it is, but you know, when I've when I go back to playing a game that I played a lot and sort of was struggling with, if I come back to it a, l a while later. Usually, usually it's a little bit smoother. Sit. So yes. So we got another title here, Ivy Master. So I guess that yeah, that was for using his uh, his boost break or his boost art to stun enemies. Oops. All right. Yeah, I have to press. I have to press down on the right stick. I was just pressing in directions with the right stick, and I wasn't getting any results. Yes, perfect evading guarding. I don't know how much I want to rely on that, considering my <laughs> my track record. I did okay there, I guess. Yeah, solitary captivity. Boost gauge for enemy downs. Art casting resilience. Those could all be pretty good, but I'm not really I've looking to spend to too go. much, too many points right now. Oh, another another herb. Nice. I'll hold on to that. Please do. I'd hate it if you lost it because that was a you know a permanent buff. Oh, speaking of which, I also went in and used some of those a while ago. Is that yeah? They're in the consumables tab. So yeah, I went through and I used up all of the all of the consumables we had, or not the consumables, but the these uh, herbs that uh, give permanent buffs to your party members. I went through and I used them, and we had quite a lot. <laughs> I kind of wish that I had saved it for on stream just so we could I could at least show you how many we had because I really wasn't uh I wasn't paying very close attention to it and we ended up stockpiling a lot. I'm not generally the sort of person who really stockpiles resources in games, but uh I am the person who forgets about resources in games. And so I sort of uh achieve the same result of things not getting used. <laughs> So yes, one layer or another. So yeah, I also, I don't remember if I did this on stream or not, but I also adjusted the, each character's, uh, or I adjusted the, the tactics we're using. So we've got a few sets of, a few new sets of tactics now. We've got some new sets of tactics. I don't remember what tactics we're using currently. I don't know what tactics we're, we're currently using. Uh, and I don't remember the details of most of them, to be honest, either, so... It's going to be a bit of a, a learning experience for the both of us, I guess. And so yeah, 
I was going to talk a little bit more about Archetypes. I was going to talk a little bit more about Archetypes, but I'm going to save... I'm going to save... Uh, oh, also, I need to uh, be healing people. I forgot that I'm in charge of that now. <laughs> Despite the fact I just went from playing one character who was in charge of it to playing the other character who's in charge of it. I do wonder... There is the option to, you know, to use to heal your party outside of battle. I wonder if that's more efficient than the in-battle healing. Oh, there's an owl nearby somewhere. Somewhere. Over on the right here. Hmm. Ah, oh, there they are. I thought the shadow of that windmill there was the shadow of an enemy. I guess we'll go and pick up. Can we get? We can get through this door. I was gonna say, can we get through that window? No, we cannot. Yes. So it looks like we're gonna have to go back down by those. I believe they were called riot claws or something like that. Yeah, go past them in order to get to. Oh. What's with that shining foe pit. over there? Oh. You didn't look like that before, did you? Riot Earth claw. Okay. Oops. Alright, there we go. Focus. Oop. Okay, that was... <laughs> that was perhaps less than ideal. Alright. Law? Or, not law, sorry. Alfin. Thank you. But yes. So, like I was saying, I was going to talk about Arknights, but now I'm not going to talk about Arknights just yet, because I want to talk about Arknights when we're playing Arknights. Or at least on the day we're playing Arknights. Ooh, that's new. It's very cool looking, too. Very good, very good. So yeah, so I can pretty easily, maybe pretty easily is a, a strong term for it, but I am able to, yeah, to start and maintain combos with most other characters, even Rinwell to a certain extent, despite her also relative lack of, uh, a relative lack of uh, reliance on them. Yeah, I'm able to get combos with uh, Rinwell even to a certain extent. I can chop up vegetable scraps and use them in the seasonings. Sure to know, and that's what it was going to be about. Hmm. Yeah, even even with, even with Rinwell, I can do that, but I don't really have it down with Xion, if that's a thing that I can do. And maybe it's just not. Maybe Xion's just not the sort of character who. Uh, yeah, that definitely, that definitely seemed to be a lot more efficient than what we were doing in battle. So I guess maybe I should save in-battle healing for emergencies. Alright, so we can't jump over this fence, unfortunately. So how do we want to go about doing this? I guess we'll need to approach from higher up. Ah, that will get us down, but that won't, it'll just put us onto another fence. All right, I saw the prompt. Okay, okay. Angel wings. Soft, fluffy wings that attest the wearer's pure soul, letting them fly wherever their heart desires. Nice. Maybe something's going on in the forest. Maybe, maybe. I do, I do kind of wonder how many owls there must be, considering that we just got another milestone at 21. Which seems like a unusually non-round number. Ooh, ice cream. I think that's... I think that's something that someone wanted for one of their uh, titles. Or something like that. Yes, a sweet made by freezing milk and eggs. Though perfect in hot weather, there's something to be said for having it on cold days, too. Alright, I'm pretty sure someone wanted to have or make ice cream. Yeah, solo training grounds. There we go, meal cooked ice cream. But yeah, so we probably could uh, probably could go back and do the training grounds for each character. But since we're already out here, I'm not going to, you know, go back. I'm not going to go back just yet. Yes, yeah, so I would like to do a little bit more exploring, at least. I don't know. Let's see. Fortress ruins, ground elevator. Hmm. Oh, another fishing spot over there, actually. So I guess to to make a plan of attack, whoops, 
Well, I guess we're playing as Law now. <laughs> that's fine. We're moving around as Law anyway. So that's another sort of checkpointy area, it seems like. There's a campfire and all that there, which is probably will make our ice cream while we're there, I imagine. But yes. So that is that. Uh, where was I? Oh, yeah. So I don't think that area over there is necessarily the elevator. So I might step into the next screen over. I guess, how long have we been streaming? It took a little bit longer setting up than usual. So, yeah, again, my setup's kind of weird today. And it's going to be kind of weird going forward, but... So I guess I should start getting used to it. But, uh, let's see. There's me, there's me getting distracted again. Oh dear. Ooh, go How down this pit. How long has it been since I last went this hungry? A very long time, I imagine. But yes. So, actually, we can just drop down, can't we? Right. I guess Law's knees maybe didn't appreciate that, but he's a, he's a tough guy. He can take it. But yeah. So, where was I? Ice cream, exploring. Ah, yes. So we'll make it to here at least. We'll step through this gate here, see what's up. If it's something interesting, if it's something that's too interesting, we might just uh, save that for next time. Because again, I don't want to stay too, too long. I want to get a little bit of rest. I don't feel terribly tired, but, you know, sometimes even if you're not terribly tired, you should still get some rest. Because, yeah, I don't know. I don't feel sick, sick, but I did definitely, I could definitely feel, I don't know, I feel fine now. But I definitely didn't feel so fine later, so I don't want to push it too much. But yeah, so it's been about 50 minutes. I think I took about... <clears throat> 20 to 30 or so to get started. So we're not in any Let's danger of running out of time or anything. Work in this I never miss. Okay, if I... Oh, I was gonna... Yeah. No. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah okay. <laughs> Pardon. So yes, I was not quite sure there. I was not quite sure there whether or not I uh, had positioned Xion such that she could shoot both of them. And it really looked like she shouldn't have been able to shoot both of them, but she did, and I'm glad for it. I appreciate that about her. She's quite capable. But yes. So, let's see. That was me talking about our exploration plans for right now. Other than that, we might do a little bit of fishing once we get to our, our destination. Definitely going to do a little bit of ice cream making. Perhaps using some of that, that frozen hammer ice. Next time, do you think we could add some more flames into the mix? H huh? It's not that easy to adjust, you know. Fair enough. Mm -hmm. There we go. I was concerned we might need to go at that from another angle, too. Yeah, we got another... Hey, what I don't do you know if these enemies, like, enemy. despawn or anything. The shining enemies. <clears throat> I've got a really bad feeling about... Are these... These feel like armored enemies a little bit. Okay, and they, they indeed are, because they, yeah, got boost broken. Boost broken by, uh... Yeah, boost... Eat, yeah. Boost broken by our good friend, uh... Actually, that's probably a charge, too, yeah. So they're charged, they're charging enemies and they're armored enemies. Very nice. Alright, not bad, not bad. Not bad, not bad. Ooh, ooh, I don't think I've seen Soaring Blast before. But I'll tell you what I have seen. I've seen Alfin low on HP before, so let's uh do something about that. Very good. And on the ground. Heal. I still I should definitely look into whether or not I can choose who I'm targeting with my heals. There's not really... There wasn't really any reason for me to not target Alfin with that heal. It was probably the best move to do, considering circumstances. But, you know. 
it would be it'd be nice to be able to to choose manually if I really needed to uh, if I really needed to prioritize for whatever reason. Okay, so probably a lot of these are also going to be influenced by directional inputs while I input the move. I think I'm getting stronger. All right, so let's see if we can't make it a little bit further. Or at least see if there's more enemies to fight over this way. What do you not. say we check back in on the ranch? You no, know, why not? We'll do that. Ruins that once belonged to the Dana are now brimming with beasts from Rena. This scenery is about as Dana as it gets. Too true. Too true. Alright. Some more livestock. Yeah, the chickens... The chickens give chicken, I'm pretty sure. I don't think they give eggs. I don't believe they give eggs. I know that we're going to need eggs for the the ice cream, and I'm pretty sure we have some. I'm pretty sure we have some. Oh, pardon. Didn't mean to cut you off there. The only signs of human activity now are those Renan windmills and the open fires. We'll take a little bit of a rest. And we'll have a little bit of a snack. But yeah, that's another aside. Real the vermilion quick. vegetation oh. certainly gives this realm a distinct, if somber, ambiance. Seems like there's lots of fruit and plants yeah. that we can eat. I also can't help but notice the ceaseless howling of the wind. It should be easy to dry our laundry out here. I can't tell if these two are actually having a conversation or what. I do like how Kisara is being very positive about all this. Though Halim's out here writing a an impromptu poem about the desolation and the the strangeness of these of these parts and Kisara's all like oh I like this feature of the of the terrain I like this feature of the region it's nice let's hear about hey, the dark well, things what was that whole legend you were talking about earlier back when we were by the gate huh oh you mean about the dark wings it's an old story about a Danon hero that's been passed down for generations. Nice, nice. Like I said, I sure haven't heard it before. Yeah, me neither. Definitely not well, the sort of story that ago, the Renans would like to. There was an evil king who tried to bring all of Dana to ruin. Like, like to be spread However, around, I imagine. A pure black owl heard the pleas of the people and decided to help. It chose a young hero and bestowed upon them a holy flame that was capable of vanquishing the king. The story goes that the young hero challenged the king and defeated them with the flame. Seeing Dana had been saved, the people flew the crest of the Dark Wings as thanks to the owl for its help. Nice. From what I understand, it used to be a really well-known story before the Renans came. I guess our people must have forgotten it over time. It's lucky for us you still know it. You sure are well-versed in these sorts of things, Rinwell. She is you know, indeed the part where the most the cultured member of our party besides uh, reminds Dobeline. me a little of Alfin. Oh, come on, it's just a story. Besides, if we're talking about an owl helping anyone, Hudo would definitely choose to win well. Sure, I might have helped take out our own kind of evil king with the others, but I'm definitely no hero. That and Hudo's wings aren't even black. Definitely not. <laughs> All right. Gian, I hope you're ready for some more food because ice cream. All right, milk and eggs. So we've got, we've actually got quite a few eggs. Probably I could have bought some if I needed some. Because yeah, we had a merchant just there. But yes. Increases, yeah, boost duration decreases the effect. Right, right, right. Yeah, so that's a small increase to elemental attack up. Small increase to elemental attack up. Mmm, good food is the best kind of magic. Yes. So mm, elemental attack. This ice cream tastes oh, we get a, so we get a scene good. Out of it too. Nice. I swear, you're always having ice cream, even when it's freezing cold out. And who made you the food police? No one. I mean, I'm he just used to be that's sort a lot of the police. Ice cream. Don't you ever, you know, throw up or anything? I mean, this is the really first time having ice that? cream, I think. Try thinking before you talk. Huh? What do you mean? All I'm saying is I'm. Uh, I'm just a little worried about you, okay? Well, don't be. I can have ice cream whenever I want. Exactly. You say that, but you know what's going to happen if you keep eating ice cream all the time. 
It's none of your business what I eat or how often. Arguing over the consumption of a frozen mm, dairy product. very strongly about uh, ice cream. to be young. Naive might be more accurate. All right. No one to, in particular to, to speak with. But I don't think we've had the... We've Maybe we've had the chance, but I don't think we've taken the chance to, I to hang, hang out, out with Dohalim before. Let's see what he gets up to. He gets up to not appreciating the sound of a sword being polished, I guess. Fair enough. Fair enough. Do you mind watching our camp tonight? Not the sort of thing that's for everyone. Very nice. Rinwell, sugar connoisseur. Alright, I knew there was a reason I liked her. Aqueous Surge. Generate three water orbs around Rinwell that explode on contact. Ao prevention. Out gauge restored. Parts rage from critical hits. And decreased down damage. All pretty good. Sugar connoisseur. As someone with a profound sweet tooth, Rinwell always has room for dessert, even after a full meal. Shall we get moving? Yeah, so one thing I'm noticing about my setup is that the... I'm definitely getting a lower frame rate on my second monitor here than I am on my... Or I'm getting a lower frame rate on my main monitor here than I am on the one that is my laptop. <laughs> that is built into my laptop. And yes, we are going to do some fishing. There's something in the water. There is. It's fish. They're being very respectful of our of our fishing. Let's see. This isn't a place that is connected to the sea. Hey, what do you think about that spot? Good idea. I don't think. I'll go for that one. I would assume that the sea would be. I was going to say downstairs, but that's not. That's not the term for it. But yes, it would be. <clears throat> down river, rather. It would be down river. I guess I don't know what fish live in these parts. There we go. I also don't remember super well what the fishing controls are like. Do I need to? Hmm, I don't remember if I need to hold the uh, hold the button to reel in. Okay, yeah. If I hold the button, she reels in. Oh, okay. Good. good. The fish is getting weak, but I am, yeah, I am also getting weak. Unfortunately, I cannot live up to Kisara's uh, example, but maybe. Hmm. Square, triangle, square, triangle, square. Brings in this fish, whatever this is. Oops. Okay, I don't think we're going to get this one. I'll get you next time. We had a chance there. We got a chance there, so maybe I was a little bit too pessimistic. Oops. Hmm. Oh, right. Is this... Okay, no, it just improves our... Improves our ability to catch certain fish. You're rather still than... not done fishing yet? Boring. You need patience to fish. Listen, you can, you can go find something else to do if you really want to, Law. All right, nothing here. Oh, nope, there is a creature here right. that is interested in the square triangle rhythm. I don't know, I guess I'm not... Maybe we'll save the fishing for, like, later. We'll do a, a fishing episode. Because, yeah, right now I feel like I just do not... I do not know enough about the fishing in this game to really, uh... I don't know enough about the fishing in this game to really... I don't, I'm not very good at it, basically. We caught a fish there. Looks like I hooked a pretty rare fish. Oh, and it's a rare one, I too, apparently. even better at this. But yes. I don't know, I don't feel like I'm... Hold on. Salmon, is that... What fish do we need? Hold on. I remember there's a specific fish that we wanted for some dish. Me. Can we check what our recipes are? Yes, we can. And we... We can check what our recipes are, but we can't check what... 
how to make them. I remember there's a there's a fish recipe that I wanted to get because it gets me more XP. And I remember there was a fish that we needed for that that was like I don't know. It was something that lives in waters that are connected to the sea or something. The vermilion vegetation mm. certainly gives this realm a We can still back out. Yeah, okay. Leaf wrapped fish. That's what it is. So we need sea bream. Distinct if somber ambiance. Seems like there's mm. lots of fruit and plants that we can eat. Shion, could we talk a moment? We can't fully back out of the camping. But we can at least just uh hang out, I guess. Yeah, I guess this is a scene that we've seen before. So we could have uh, chosen someone else, someone who's see who we've hung I out think with less. it's time we go to sleep. Yeah, so I'll need to. Morning. I think I'll need to adjust to my out? settings a little bit. Might need to adjust my settings a little bit on the monitor to get it to behave in a way that is more that I like more. Because yeah, the main reason, main reason that I was doing this. <clears throat> main reason I have the game on, I have the, the reason I have the game on two monitors rather than just one is because the way that my desk is set up, I kind of have to have my laptop off to the left here. And I was kind of worried that it, or at least uh, rather last time, last time it was kind of looking off to the left constantly sort of messed up my face tracking and it looked a little bit weird, but it's not, um, I did recently move my decide to start using my my lamp I noticed uh, in my webcam that my my face was actually kind of shadowed wasn't getting enough lighting so I moved my desk lamp it's currently now sitting on top of the the case for my desktop I say move my desktop I move my desk lamp and it's currently sitting on top of the case for my desktop so now I have more lighting on my face and I can you know, move my face around a little bit more without the without the uh, losing tracking. So I guess maybe I could uh, try out just looking left for a little while and seeing what that gives me. I just remembered, yeah, we're going to we are we were meaning to proceed this way. So yeah, so hopefully this shouldn't be any particular issue for us. I think it's safe to rest here now. Hmm. All right, so that's the elevator. What time are we at? Yeah, we could we could spend a little bit more time. So let's go and let's go back to the. Uh, okay, off we go. I don't know. I don't know how much I want to drag this out. What, I guess what time is it? It is nine thirty. So I guess yeah. I don't know. I said this was going to be a short stream, so it doesn't. I guess it doesn't matter too, too here? much. It doesn't matter too, too much if it's like ten minutes short or yeah, ten minutes shorter than I sort of was anticipating. Yeah, perhaps a little bit less than ideal, but I don't know. I feel like this is a reasonable place to place to stop. Yeah, this is about as far as far as I was planning to take it uh, in terms of time and about as far as I was planning to take it in terms of uh, destination also. So I think, yeah, we will again uh, rest perhaps a little bit more than is strictly necessary, but I'm sure it will be better, better in the long run. And yeah, looking over, looking over, we've also had very little... Uh, very little uh, frame drops, so I think the I think the the settings that I that I tweaked for that have also paid off quite quite handsomely. Because yeah, I I noticed we haven't had I haven't had basically any frame drops at all recently. I haven't had any recently. I noticed some at the start of the stream. There's like a yeah about 60, 60 frames missed and 90, 90 dropped. Or 90 skipped. I don't know what that means per se. I don't know what those what those specifically mean, but yeah, one way or the other, it's less than I was getting previously. It's less than I was getting previously, and the number has not changed in a long time. So I think we're 
I think the, like I said, I think we're good, basically. It's not as big of an issue now as it used to be. So yeah. I don't know, it feels a little bit weird to, to leave it on a note of not a whole lot really having been accomplished. And again, I probably could go a little bit later than I, that I could go a little bit later if I wanted to. But, I don't know, I made my decision to make this a short stream and I'm going to stick by it. I'm going to take the opportunity to rest. Because again, that is something, not taking the opportunity to rest, uh, even, yeah, not taking the opportunity to rest really, really had a negative impact on me a lot recently. So, I don't know, getting a little bit more rest than I, than I perhaps need to, getting a little bit more rest than I perhaps need to, I think will be good, basically. So yes, so now it is time for the customary raid. If anyone has any raid suggestions, I would, as always, be delighted to hear them. Other than, or, yeah. Yeah, other, what else is there to say? Oh, right, schedule. So yeah, once again, raid suggestions if you like. If not, I can find a target. Sit. But yes, if not, I can find a target, and one way or the other, in the meantime, I'll be talking about uh, the schedule. So, not a whole, whole, whole lot to be said. So, next week will be some more of the usual. Should be back to the usual anyway. Should be Tales of Arise, Wednesday and Friday. Try to stream a little bit longer on those days, assuming that I am still feeling well. But yes, Tales of Arise, Wednesday and Friday. Some more, or some, some Arknights. Just Arknights in general, not more, because there's not been any before. <laughs> Yes, some Arc Knights on what did I say Tuesday? Right. <laughs> yes, that is the that is the day for it. Yes, some Arc Knights on Tuesday, and then some Valhalla on Thursday with our good friend Sheppy Sheps doing some more voice acting for that. Be a lot of fun. Not that everything else won't be, but you know. <laughs> yeah. So I think that's basically everything that needs to be said. I don't see any raid suggestions. So I think we're going to go and drop by someone I haven't seen in quite a quite a long time. I think they said that they were on something of a hiatus or something like that. Maybe not a hiatus, but I they haven't been uh, streaming a whole, whole lot, I think. They've been streaming less than usual. Anyway, <laughs> all of this is to say we're going to go and drop by Fairy Fae's stream. Ba -ba -ba. There we are. Get the rage started. Oops, might help if I actually type in the name of the channel. <laughs> yes, Fairy Fae. Fairy VTuber. Uh, I don't know. I don't know what else to say, to be honest. Yeah, playing some uh, Opus Magnum. Yeah, I know that that is a puzzle game. It's a puzzle game. I think it's sort of alchemy themed or something like that. Or, I don't know. Maybe themed, I guess. I know, like, you you build a machine to move things around, basically. And you try to come up with, uh, I think, like, elegant solutions to get things moved around in such a way as to make other things, basically. Which is a description that could probably be applied to a lot of games, honestly. But, uh, yeah, it is a, it is a puzzle game of some sort. It's a puzzle game that I have. It's a puzzle game that I... Have been interested in previously, but I haven't. I haven't played it. But anyway, maybe we'll see what that's about. Maybe we'll see what that's about, and uh, maybe that'll interest me a little bit more. So yes, the customary raid message is, as always, we have arrived. There we go. Customary raid message is, as we, as always, we have arrived. And so, also as always, thank you for being here tonight. I hope that you will continue to have a fine night. Or wait, hold on. I hope that you have had a fine night. I hope that you will continue to have a fine night. And I hope that you will uh, raid. Uh, bye. <laughs>